Yembra, the fan is the unfaithful day. Ah, um, it ended the fame of G Man. Um, at the end, you see, on that fateful day, um, oh, I'm you see, it. Yeah, come, Uncle for Christ. Je, 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 January 9th, 1995. That's correct. And he may catch us answer near interview. Um, yeah, yeah, research. And he may pass a bear ordinary interview. Sure. So we went to Domi CFC. Yeah. Where the incident took place. Yeah. And then, so I taxi rank in the hobby. And, uh, Crophobia Brewa, or my better story in the crowd, but no money because that time now, Sad Domain CFC on a home beer case and then yet developed to send the N. Domain CFC on it here. Eighty nine percent was I say at the end, the sea was Sad Domain CFC area. Okay, so basically, I'm on an amity. Namity Domain CFC, the name of the street is Salt Street. Now, if you go into the book, you will find. An illustration of the street i want you to go there so that remember canal you can easily follow it into just maybe our uh amsterdam pictures you know? okay it should have been on the okay. page to the left of that pictures okay um and i want an amity into an opabia masori uh it was a monday morning january 9th and uh uh, you catch him, you say, Menya visitor. And I'm so okay, my visitor, and I'm right. I'm about to be 7 30. And she, I'm a catch him, said, or the taxi nearby. And I'm so okay, you taxi ne cana uncle because Waba, uh, enemy be didn't come on. I think that it's going to be in Koma, everyone, you know, on chair. But you're home, but you're home, meet you, pa. And she, the street is called the Salt Street. And it runs from the east to the west. And me fear who rest street more me fear in the toss of four as a remark to the right. And all what the west side. Yes, the west side. So um because we could see a taxi in the car. Um by no see taxi driver and so badge four thousand. I'm saying four thousand cities. Now why four thousand? And now um I can say taxi driver and say, you know, we're gonna watch a cra in Tino. And in 1980, um, 1995, as I'm saying, I'm not dropping your 1,000 cities and a uh, one hour charter, a uh, 2,000 cities. In Tin, why is the driver charging 4,000? That is 20 pesos today. Okay, 4,000, which is 40 pesos today. Okay, and he um, make quite seven minutes ago, reason up the coin or so, maybe on the 4,000 nano bench. And I'm so okay. Let us compromise. My main mouth three thousand. Into me by a fee back from the three thousand. No, and my say I'm from Komano. And I'm a call. Cause she see me. I'm me fee jarry kwa. Into me cause she see me. No ana. Ni pana ba beka chum se. We two car no cause se on this car no. Into no one this car no. Into me I thought said that was the end of the case. My several, uh, your several medjani and me be di di, and I will be by myself. I say, only me be can recording so once because I had a recording studio at home at that time. It's yet not porch na I will feel any, and I na me di di na me tie crashing any the demo or the abba. About an hour later, the moon said, "Get me." A pun will be a p a p and f a bunting a b a b a ni pan a few steps. And then they started to collect sand on the floor into a polythene bag. It's a bit of a thing, you know. I'm not going to be in the driveway and I get to it. So I didn't make up immediately send a taxi driver. No. And then I open. And why the meaning of this? And I say, the fact that he refused to pay him his taxi fare and he's going to kill everybody in the house. to pay him his taxi fare and he's going to kill everybody in the house. So I was like, ah, now nah, I don't know about Ruby Fee, you know, I threatened to kill everybody in the house. You don't even know how many people 
I in the south. Now besides, ni pano full car. Who nim so tifia na so tifia. So when I started to reason with him, no my natural reaction is say mindi nechi immediately to prevent him because that time na mi nim yame. Ain't you know? And I me mami so feel at Mi mi so no ye ye catch me about a konudi. So we see so we name unya the kwa konudi what they are. So I panicked and went into my room, decided to say, okay, let me pick a pistol and maybe with a pistol I can frighten him and get back my son. And to see the narrative has changed from fear to death, death and son. And son. So, uh, but when the story was being told, the narrative was say, oh be the car by me fee in a car three thousand four thousand and me two them the bono and that was not what happened so i get out of the street and no new social narrative now you see say the car is packed our top four four houses, houses away in a in a in a curb on a junction of and, a, and an incident this see or curve on the hall okay in the in the intersection and as uh -huh. junction right the junction so I want to make a tone. No? Yeah, the yeah the um, diagram, no. Ato, uh, yeah, um, yeah, Facebook, no. Open social incident, baby. See, yeah, baby, yeah. There's a book in Nana or Tom. Yeah, 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 yeah. He just, um, no, I get uh, it. I get it. I'm only joking. Um, so, it, so, so at the junction is where men and the shots say, I argue over the sun. Nana can't see you throw off the carnation and I want to back down. Uh -huh. it, the junction right first and, house before your house right and see the argument started there because you see i'm a tumia cotono and the argument started so i thought of firing a warning shot so my little thinking and little mind says if fire a warning shot maybe that will frighten him and okra and i say i said me fire a warning shot so share now, who can say Mr. Rotu? Hey! I am not moved by this. You see, so I'm saying this. And the reason I've written this book is for people to know these things. Because there are so many hypes that we grew up thinking that Charlie will be bad or so shoot to one and shoot to be Johnny. When you have not met the nitty gritty itself, you will not understand what I am talking about. So, what I didn't realize. Okay, so Mishuti and the ladies that were in the house followed up when they heard a gunshot. And it didn't immediately follow up. Until we are still arguing. Charles was the guy that was with me. They started to convince him to calm down. Because Tempest was still going up. They ran off of our taxi. I ran off of our taxi. I ran off of our taxi. And I'm saying, no. I don't think the tune is safe with you. Because this guy... It's really angry. And when you told him, I don't know if you told him, he said, all of us are dead. In the midst of this chaos, it told him, I'm going to an automatic pistol. I mean, so I'm not trained in guns. So my being crazy is to say, I'm fire a warning shot. I reload without knowing this. In the chance, I'm going to calm down here and I'm going to back to the house. I'm going to reverse the case. Your trap first house. Follow the illustration. We are coming back. You do the second house. Yes, I park second house. No, there's a junction to the right. Then I said something that angered him. Said, Why would you do such a thing? And then he he turned and attacked me. Because mm. I want to cheat immediate. Until when I said that and he turned. He came straight to lunch at me and my natural reaction was to lift the hand that had the gun. And then because the gun was already in a firing position. I clock it. He hit the bridge of his nose. And that's how the gun went off. And to look at the distance and even the time that the warning shot was given and the time the fatal discharge happened. It was something that was not instant as people made it out to look like say oh jim and taxi buy and if he then also on piano run it them for a tune or the bono 
It's good, sir. Watcher and Woman. The untold story of the shocking journey from pop stardom to the death row, from fame to shame. Uh, page 156. Uh, what the diagram uh, illustrates and I say, the incident in the ACA and the ABA. Um, and I know we the untold side, no better chim. A bit was a rabana or Bethel was your girlfriend, and that is how the news reported. She was my ex girlfriend, okay. Your ex girlfriend, yeah. then okay. Sorry, <laughs> no, there's nothing <laughs> to me, she was my ex girlfriend, yes. Now we hear what a brutal but you are. Tell your ex girlfriend, but you are. And uh, Obesra were Kofasa is saying by no crap. Um, where was Jagapi in the case? I would, uh, humility plead not to discuss somebody that I don't have permission to discuss him. And you know, I would rather not talk about him because he's not in the book, only book in him, mm -mm. but he was charged as an accomplice to you in the case as it was reported yes not from me not from me uh, uh you see people this is why people need to read this book to understand as soon as say you're charging me and i'm say this is my accomplice that is not what happened somebody who was in his house said he saw him hold the taxi driver do you understand mm. and and this is why he was arrested it is not your damfo. Uh no your G man a damfo. Okay, no your G man a damfo mm. then. Actually, no in a damfo. I think it's no in a work colleague. Maybe that's a better word. Okay. Yeah. But one chuny didn't wo book him. Because it's not part of the story. This is my story. Okay. I get you. <laughs> I get you. But I um, mean story na yen yati. Mm -hmm. You are now telling us the untold part of the story. That's right. The ayen yeti yene se na jagapi eka oho one o ne wo enti mehu di enti a story you know a woman a watch you know he's not being featured in it. Wa ma u permission. Um, that's that's what I'm saying. Sir. This is about me. I took responsibility for what happened. Okay. And and that's that's. That's what I can defend. That's what I I can't speak for somebody. Okay, you 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 were charged and both sentenced. He got I mean um, some years of sentence and you were put on death row. Yeah, uh, were you in the same prison? Yes. Most thirty prisons burn Wako because I have some of the prisons. I, I went to James Fort. Mm -hmm. Who were arrest? I was arrested to Tessano Police Station. Was the first place. And from Tesano, into my primary school at Tesano, and I'm secondary school at James Fort, and I'm university a condemned in his own. So that's where I graduated from. Daily Graphic, Thursday, May 16, 1990, number 141, price 300 CDs. G Man to Die, page 251 of your book. Mm -hmm. Prison officer shoved G-Man into the car yeah. for the journey to Insawom Medium Security Prison. Picture by Sam Isuman and Abel Hansen. G-Man father writes and two other siblings could not believe what they heard. Is G-Man going to be killed? G-Man to die. The end of a pop star. That's right. <laughs> so why didn't you die? Because God... Is no man and the things that God desires no man can understand because God has a purpose for each and everybody's life it's it's very important that we understand this oh I am alive because God wants me alive Huh. Um, I mean, well, I'm waiting for you. <laughs> uh, yes, yes, because I, ha I, I think say I had no means. So, my fuck crap, my bottle. Sanity, when you get to know the truth of the story, 
that's why it's important that everybody should hear the untold story so that people can understand the truth um, as I'm here, everybody has their version um my visit and crawl forward then james fort prison yeah i won't mention names but um before i almost back close down the james, james fort prison you know, yeah uh, sunday is not make a strong crawl forward okay and the pictures now me who need you know i'm a wakai my car is giving you a flashback right um let me tell you any papa here the command be no many easy said they're not almost the whole attitude and he walk james fort prison mm -hmm. and i woke up in someone prison uh, yes it would be how many years was on prison um yeah 13 years and um four months and i, I was transferred to ankafo local prison and then i spent six months there and then i was released so i got a total of 14 years on the day 14 years on the day means that I was arrested on the 9th of January and I was released on the 9th of January. The untold story. You tried to appeal. Oh, appeal here. Yeah. yeah, and it was a story, a story by Stephen Saar on Thursday, June 15, 2006. Uh, produce records of G-Man's appeal. Supreme Court orders register. Okoya could do Supreme Court. That's right. But that was not God's plan. God had another avenue. But I had to go through um, the law as much as I could. Um, Your action, mm. ah, Emma, the incident, Emma, driver, Nini, we are not. Yeah. Obi Bet Miyaka said, self defense. Even though, sir, no, on Uncra, a tool, but. Mm. Um, and now why are aggressive and said they are no when you're trained you know to handle gun and now we need how uh, you know automatic revolver no um you know ammunition maybe a quack shame uh, why couldn't you win the appeal you know say oh say you because did not deliberate yeah because my plea i didn't plea for self-defense i plea for accidental death okay that i take responsibility for the person dying but it happened accidentally and not intentional unfortunately the laws did not support it because i was tried in the public opinion the court of public opinion and Ghanaians are more emotional than reasonable mm -hmm. so people did not reason to analyze it i didn't have any criminal past because i had not committed any offense before look in 19 um 86 sorry 96 not 86 96 there was a holland player near friend patrick clivet mm -hmm. okay just before the uh european cup of nations then a car mm -hmm. so he was drunk and killed the child now they could have uh, sentenced him into imprisonment but the holland needed him so they decided to tell my man a community work by teaching children how to play football of sending him to prison okay i pleaded guilty and accepted it said it was accidental and i was expecting said i would have been given a manslaughter sentence but they decided to charge me with murder murder means that you had the intent to kill which i did not and this is why today ghana law report law students are studying my case mm -hmm. but you see they are studying the wrong case because the facts of the matter is not true but you lost appeal at was supreme court yes so it you, was still you will it, lose appeal it, it was still it will still be in the um the law report yes and you, anything i was watching your book yes you will lose anywhere you go because when the foundation of the law mm -hmm. gets it wrong it's wrong throughout like you said we are more emotional than reasoner right and people cannot analyze things very well. Uh, uh, that uh, incident you see, you know, mm. it is a dummy CFC taxi drivers, you know, you know, I'm about fee, yeah, I'm about and come now and come It is like a police for no crime, bam, but chua, you would have been killed by the taxi driver, probably. Yes, we went to the courts, they did the same thing the first time, but, but, yes. But let me tell you something very interesting. Years later, a man I'm all condemned that we had to make a call uh, because I was not well, and they didn't call And after the treatment, 
we come and sit outside and wait for the prison van to come. A picket, uh, those who were taken to court, you now be fine in our hospital. And as I sat down there, the taxi drivers at Kolibu ran and recognized me. And guess what happened? They came over to me and they said, Gee, man, we are praying for you that very soon God will bring you home. The same taxi drivers that wanted to kill me at one stage now are praying for my release. The Bible says in the book of Proverbs 16, verse number 9, it says that when a man's way pleases the Lord, he makes him to be at peace even with his enemies. That is the transformation of God. Somebody will ask, how did you get out? And yet the family of the disease and the true petition wow. on my behalf. And that's how I came home. Oh my goodness. Jesus. Sabi Nipanoa, taxi driver now, who could know Ebusian for and the true petition. I come out government. Yeah. And now government is releasing you. Yeah. That's why people have to read the book to know the truth. When our prison, you know, now, um, our family and they. The deceased family, you know, now I'm all in talks, and now. Yeah. Because they needed to to let them know that he was not my enemy, and they accepted it. And guess, guess what happened? Which is not in the in this book is going to be in the next book. Is the reconciliation between me and the family? Oh. The day, the day I came out and went to meet the family. Nyomokai is what I'm repeating, quoting the Bush Um I say today is a happy day, they say Waba. And it's a sad day. We've lost a son, but we've gained a son into our family. So they see me as a son now. The taxi driver's daughter I have taken care of from day one till now she has finished college. And she's my my daughter. She calls me dad. The untold story of G-Man. G love G-Man from fame to shame. Okay, FM. Okay. One zero one point seven.